Hello everyone and welcome here to the Homestead Miami Speedway for round number two here of the Proco IndyCar Series Box Season 2. This is our first time here at Homestead for the IndyCar Series drivers here in Miami, Florida. Um, should be a pretty interesting race as uh, these IndyCar drivers take on the track once again as Stephen Colon in the 33 will start on the pole. Wyatt Williams to his outside. Here are the commands. Ladies and gentlemen, start your engines. The commands have been given here. The engines are fired up down there on the pit road. And the driver's getting set to roll off. Hopefully everyone gets going here. So far, so good. Doesn't look like there's any issues. So, a rather interesting race out there in Phoenix. We came all the way across the country here to Homestead. It was uh, Dwayne Singletary capturing the win out there at Phoenix. That was his uh, third win. Um, he starts near the front, as you can see him in that yellow car right there. Um, starting P number three. A lot of uh, winners are starting up here. Um, Steve Colon, of course, on the pole. Won uh, St. Petersburg last season. Wyatt Williams, of course, being a defending Indianapolis 500 winner. And then Singletary with the three wins he have. As we look back here, Abrahamian Miller, Gutierrez, Young, are as well as in all those guys. Um, one driver that is um, on probation is Christian Russell in the 19. I remember after the last round, causing an incident where um, Rookie Wells flipped over, I believe it was. And um, if any incidents occurs with the 19 of Russell, they will be suspended indefinitely here. So the crowd, full, full, full crowd on hand here today. As Steven Colon in the 33 looking for another win here in the IndyCar Series. He will start on the pole and will lead us to the green for 14 laps of racing here at Homestead. Already there fanning out. Doesn't look like some guys got started too good back there as they're going to go really Hark tight out, right here. Out, in the middle, gotta be careful. Oh, we got a wreck in the back. Car, cars are around in the back here. Looks like Sam and Austin and Calhoun. Calhoun. I have no idea how to pronounce that name. I want to say Calhoun. I have no idea. But the four of Dwayne Singletary with the race lead here. Steve Cologne line up second behind him as he'll come around and lead us to the yellow here on lap number one. As um, we'll try to go back and get you a look at that replay here. Uh, this is going into corner number one here. Jesse O'Connor, oh, makes contact with Sam and Oskin, and Connor slams that outside of the wall. So did Sam and Oskin, and then Calhoun, I believe is how you say it. He went around as well. Another look at it here. It looks like Sam and Oskin may have checked up, and then... Okay, or actually, no, it looks like um, Calhoun just got turned up into them both. And that's what started that whole mess right there. So we'll go on board here with... Three wide, two level man's side. Ooh, yeah, this is with Jesse O'Connor's. Get into the wall right there. So those three guys are definitely going to be damaged for sure. Four is out front. We'll be back. Welcome back here to Homestead, Miami. So we're getting set to go back green. Still all 31 drivers on the track. As the four is out front, Stephen Colon, Wyatt Williams, third. Chris McCann, the rookie up in fourth. And Lauren. 14 currently runs in the fifth position so most of our laps have been completed under yellow here hopefully we can get some green flag racing as the four continues to lead Dwayne Singletary and we're green once more great start right there by the four Singletary not so much for Stephen Cologne White Williams right there may try to take advantage of that back there in third. Nope, here comes Chris McCann, the rookie in the eight. Trying to go for a podium position. Three wide now for second behind Dwayne Singletary. And this time we're able to get out of that corner just fine. So you go down the back stretch, a lot of close racing. Edgar Meade making his way up to the front as well. And there's Sam Oskin in the trailing in the back with that damage. As out of the corner. 03 wide back back there as you see Christian. Oh, Russell gets into the wall. A bit of contact right here. Christian with him and Christian Elder. Really close call right there. Is, ooh. Two young drivers have a bright future ahead of them. I'll, I'll say. Oh, we got a car around. Into the grass. 
Oh, that's why Williams be careful coming back up on the track here. Oh, no, 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 no. And he gets into other drivers hard into the wall. Joe Bean. And I don't know who else that was. Yellow's out. That was Hiller. The rookie and at the line again. Dwayne Singletary with the race lead. But that could have really been avoided right there. Not sure what Williams was thinking. Very, very dangerous. Driving right there. Is he going to get turned by Edgar Meade? Looks like Meade just went up the track. And he was just kind of dogging him from behind. Put in a pressure for position and then turn him. He tried to avoid going into that inside wall. Did a great job right there. But I don't know if he tried to slow down and the grass is wet. It did rain overnight, but then came back up right. He, he should have been on the brakes and just sl slides, right, slides right back up on the track. And big hit for Joe Bean and Williams as well. Not what you'd expect from a veteran driver here. Got on board with Joe Bean. Soak on the bottom, soak on the bottom. Leave room down there. Yeah, he had no idea Williams was going to come back up and slams that outside wall. Looks like he was okay as he was able to drive away immediately. Get over there to the tough, tough break for those drivers, but... And he's going to retire out of the race, but the four is out front once again. We'll be back here at Homestead. Welcome back here to sunny Miami, Florida for round number two of the Pro Career IndyCar Series Mock Season 2. Getting set to go by green. And uh, we're gonna only going to have about three or four laps of racing here. The 9 and the 28 both out of the race. The 9 with a gearbox and 28 with a camshaft. So as we get set to go by green, you can see your top five here. A lot of these uh, young drivers are really going to try and focus on getting a podium position because... Dwayne Singletary, I tell you, raw talent here in the IndyCar series. Won the last two races last season. He's trying to win the first two this season. We're green once more. Not a good start by Chase Miller right there. He holds the final podium position. Behind him, Steven Cologne not waiting. He wants a position now. Chase Miller, he's going to have to try and rebound from that restart right there. As he's trying to protect his podium position right now as Dwayne Singletary now trying to tr holding, um, trying to hold off second place. In the back, they're racing pretty hard as well. Coming to the line, two to go this time by. Clear right there, two to go. As his spotter clears him right there, two laps to go. Miller has a run. His only win coming at Texas last season. Trying to get win number two here. A really good battle for the podium position, but with them being side by side, this may as well may as well give the win here to the four. As he's breaking the draft, a bit of contact right there between those guys. A couple guys back there nearly into the wall. Side by side for second. And Miller, he drives it in the corner. Wow, great driving by Miller. Chase Miller, P2. White flag, one more time to go here at Homestead. Oh, and here we go. Crossover move by second place. Into the corner. He drives it in there. Rookie Chris McCann looking for a win number one. Trying to get by second place. Chase Miller as they drag race down a backstretch. More contact. They got to be really careful with that here. Final lap, boys. Final corner. Look at McCann. The rookie drives it in the corner. And I believe he's going to slide up just a bit, but none of that matters. Dwayne Singletary, fourth career win in the number four. Great driving right there by Dwayne Singletary. Dominated the race, and it pays off big with his fourth career win right there. Most all-time. Giving a little bump right there to McCann. Those are, guys are two great friends. McCann went to Singletary when he started here as they kind of stacking up back there. But Chris McCann did go to Singletary before the season started and said, Hey man, any tips? Singletary told him, just drive it like you know he can. But wow, Singletary is going to get the win. McCann is going to get a runner-up and Chase Miller holds the final podium position. Gregory, uh, Gregory, Greg, Greg, Gregory Flaubert, I believe is how you say it, is um, fourth and Stephen Cologne fifth. Amy Fisher, Lauren, Mead, 
Uh, Christian Elder, Zane Davidson running out your top 10. Joshua Wells and Joe Bean did not finish the race. Four wins. The last two races last season, he won them. The first two races this season, he won them. Um, just such a great driving here by the four of Dwayne Singletary. He's what every driver looks up to now, or he's who every driver look up, looks up to, and young drivers who wanted to join the series too look up to him as well. Fourth win for Dwayne Singletary. Great performance has always dominated a race ever since he took the lead. But that's going to be, be it here from Homestead, Miami. The next race, we head to Indianapolis for the Indianapolis 500. Thank you guys for watching. Dwayne Singletary, that's win number four. Can he be defeated? We'll see you at Indianapolis.